Earlier this morning, Officer Tyler Moldovan was shot multiple times protecting and serving our community. We know that the doctors and the medical staff at the hospital are doing everything they can possible to save him. This kind of incident sends shockwaves throughout our entire valley. There are no words <clears throat> when this kind of incident happens. But I do have to remind you that we're days away from the holidays. So the details as I know them as we stand, just before two o'clock this morning, several officers were searching an apartment complex when a suspect opened fire on Moldovan and shot him multiple times. The other officers on scene acted quickly and were able to get the suspect into custody. None of our Phoenix police officers were able to fire their weapons. Right now, our homicide detectives are on scene and it's the very early stages of the investigation, so I won't have any details on those. So we're asking the patience of the community and the media as we try to put the pieces of this puzzle together. And as soon as we get more information, we will release it to us. Officer Moldovan just celebrated his 22nd birthday last month. He's been with our department for a year and a half. He graduated the academy in March of this year and recently became a solo officer. Again, we're asking you to keep the Moldovan family, Tyler, Chelsea, the 61 King Squad, the Phoenix Police Department, and our entire community in your thoughts and prayers. And I can say this, Tyler is doing exactly what we expect our police officers to do, and that's fight, and that's continue to fight. So uh, please keep us in your thoughts and your prayers. Thank you. Uh, so, so what I can tell you is that the medical staff is doing everything possible um, to, to, to try to save Tyler. Um, and he's in there fighting because that's what, that's what he does. I see the tears in your eyes. We've been hearing you speak with tears in my eyes. What was it like to get that call at 2.30? It's a call no one wants to get. His family doesn't want to get the call. My executive team doesn't want to get the, the, the call. But uh, the irony of this whole thing is that our officers put this uniform on every day not knowing what's going to happen to them. Okay, Chief Jerry Williams emotional during this update telling us that Officer Tyler Moldovan shot multiple times. This started off, Rachel, as um, police searching an apartment around 2 a.m. They say the suspect opened fire and Officer Moldovan was shot multiple times. Yeah, fortunately, the officers who were with them during that search were able to take that suspect into custody without any of the officers there having to fire their weapons. We don't have any information about what they were looking for in that search, but we do know that Officer Tyler Moldovan, just 22 years old, just celebrated his birthday recently. His wife, Chelsea, of course, at the hospital as well, praying for his recovery. He is fighting, as Chief Williams said. Um, he's only been with the force for a year and a half, so a fairly new officer. He's only been on solo duty since March of this year. So just a heartbreaking situation for Phoenix police right now and all law enforcement really in the state yeah. as they pray for him to, to recover from these multiple gunshot wounds. Yeah, Chief Williams saying Tyler is fighting and will keep fighting as doctors do everything that they can do to help him right now. So shockwaves through the community, something else that the chief said during that press conference that we just took live right here at 12 News. And of course, we will continue to follow this story throughout the morning and bring you any updates as we can on Officer Tyler Moldovan.